So I know these two have played a decent amount. I want to say that Luma has the winning record. Um, I don't know for sure. He did not air dodge no already, so I don't know what Tim was looking for. But again, I respect it. It would have killed had he hit yeah. it. Yeah, and it would have been really funny. Yeah. Every time I open I'm, up the bag, I, 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 thought, I thought he was doing it, and then he was going to shift towards the stage at the last second, like do it as like a bait. Yeah. And yeah. he just went pulling. I wonder if that's what he tried to do and just messed it up, but. Possibly. I'm not sure. Say. Uh, so, Angling Rob. They've plot this. This matchup has probably been played a billion times already. Yeah, uh, they haven't played today, um, but I do know that they've played yeah. in the past. Ugh. Can they hear us? Can you hear me, gamer? No, it's not like I can hear us anymore. Just probably for yeah. the best. Honestly. I was going to say, yeah, <laughs> they shouldn't be able to hear us because then I'd be distracted. Be too funny. Assuming we're going to be wasting a little time here. Ooh, <laughs> never mind. You can probably tell me more about this character than I could. We are going to be seeing Pyramithra Rob. I love this character. I, I said that. I said that was not the right, uh, not the right wording for that. So that was a. Uh, this is already an interesting start. So Mithra likes to press buttons, mm -hmm. but she also dies really, really early off stage, especially to Rob. Yeah. How how heavy are they? Knots. Very heavy. Okay. I don't know the exact. Uh, Do they weigh differently? <laughs> You're asking a whole lot of questions okay. about. Hey. Like I said, you play them more than me. Yeah, I um, want to say that power weighs a little bit more, but I also have no idea, and I would not be surprised if they weighed the same. Um, this matchup is actually pretty funny because uh, you eventually, in order to like kill, so yeah, I was gonna you say you just get a hard read. I was gonna say after the the last patch, um, Mithra has a harder time killing heavies because the last patch made it so that um, her neutral B uh, no longer was weight independent and now heavier characters can actually live it further. Okay. So it was really silly beforehand because Mithra could hit some character like Bowser or DDD at like 70% and just kill them with it. But uh, now it's how it should be. And it makes it a little harder for Mithra to kill with anything besides, like, a high percent up smash or a decently high percent F smash. Which is what we saw that, that last uh, stock. We finally got the first Pithra of the game for one jab combo and then yeah. me switching back. Okay. So it's a little, um... That should be it. Yeah. It's a little scary for uh, Pyra here. Because if you do try to do a uh, side B as Pyra, and okay, you can just get F smashed again. If you do try to do side B as Pyra, you could also, or you can always get that reflected by Rob. So it's not something that you want to like use very often. But I think he knows that because he's really been sticking to uh, Mithra in this matchup. Yeah, sitting on the platform again, Luma is someone who really likes to try and slow things down if he's feeling kind of overwhelmed. Which is good, try and kind of shift that momentum, kind of recollect yourself. But it looks like it's working out for him. Yep. He's turning alive. Ooh. Gonna go deep. Hey, you gotta... If you're behind, you have to, uh... Yeah. I was gonna say, if you're behind, you have to land these uh, edge guards on my on Mithra. I was called her Myra. That would have been a weird. Because um, it's not actually that difficult to ledge guard this character, and if you play against her enough times, you can see just how you your character should ledge guard the side B or the up B. Especially as well, with so many projectiles and different tools. Kind of yeah. Because I, I do believe if Top does not beat it, I'm pretty sure it knocks away Top. But I think everything else Rob has, like um, like charging a forward smash or a downer or something. Thank you again, Max, the 
data man. Colorado was double eliminated by Luma last week. Makes sense. I think, uh, that was a nice neutral beat. I think what I wanted to see from, uh, from Colorado here is I, yeah, I was gonna say, he might be going for these forward smashes. He needs to try to go for, um, down tilt in the neutral B, because if that's a, uh, if that's, if the DI isn't perfect Man, with the up smash, up smash out of shield. Yeah, if the DI isn't perfect from Rob, Rob is so big that, um, at basically any percent after, like, 60, uh, my, or Mithra with, uh, down tilt into neutral B can just kill you. So I want to see some of that, but... If not, that's fine. Who going to game two? Sticking with small battlefield. The new PS2. Yeah, PS2 should honestly be removed. It's a classic at this point. Yeah, I guess. But... Too, many, too many, too many gamers like it to get rid of it. That's, that's true. Problem with, that's the problem with pretty much anything in Smash. It just becomes a standard. Also, I have been informed we can still be heard on the stream. So, oh, well, no. let's go. Let's go. I mean, I, I guess you can call it mid-set coaching, but there would be a delay. Uh... Ooh, what was that? Is that, that a down smash? smash? I don't know the animation called the but yeah. I assume that smash wasn't any of the other ones. C drop but does not get the hit. Gets the up tilt. That's gonna be the first stock for Rob. Yeah, her up tilt is obscenely fast. I mean I think it's like that's gonna take that stock. Oh wait, no, it's not. Oh, really good guy. And avoiding the down air, but that is re-grab. Yeah, I've noticed Luna has not been punishing any re-grabs. Yeah. I'm not really too sure why. Or if he's just kind of messing up the inputs, or what exactly? Yeah. Now we got Mithra combos here. And that sure is Bats Within. You're just racking up the percent. Yeah, Mithra absolutely did not need that, uh, foresight, but I'm glad she has it, because it's really funny. Yeah, it is funny, but, uh, again, like you said, something that was absolutely not needed. Um... Ooh, I do like want to see... Kind of the bad bags. Yeah. A nice nair in the side beat, and that is just gonna take gonna die, it. It's 70 after the hit. 70 percent. That's fun time, and but... And evens it right out. Yep, gets immediately up aired by that Pyra. Down tilt, up air, forward air. If you can keep these Mithra combos going for 50% each time, you only need to land a couple and it should not be hard to, uh, yeah. to look for a, a kill switch. Yeah, switching over to the Pithra, just gonna be looking to... Oh, Should do it. Oh, he has been really good on those, so he shouldn't be dying at like 80 to that. But Rondo looking like he uh, he was pressing too many buttons from uh, from trying to mash there, but it looks okay. like he's calmed down, gotten stage control. Not giving Luma an opportunity to land. Nice dash, dash attack. I was gonna say, what was that side B? Was that up air? No, was that, that was up air. Okay. I just know that I know that, like down air and stuff like that can spin to the sides as well. Yeah, that was a forward okay. aerial, and I don't have any idea why Rob side beat there because there was man, nothing. Look, man, look at Tim Prater in the background with that long hair. I, since I know, me. since I know, he oh can god, hear us, like, at us. And then there's dry stain on the side, kind of getting right like in there. I don't like you guys hearing hands. me. Go away, Justin. No, Tim, don't do that. That's a good stream. I see Brandstar! Hi, Brandstar! 
Let's go, Brainstar. No, put that away. Yeah, put that away, Dry Stain. Dry Stain. I like how everyone's having oh, fun. And it did, and it did, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that was from Tim. Alright, here we go. Game, Rondo, game three, going oh, back to the new stage. Very, very serious right yeah, now. Yeah, Lumas at least got headphones. I don't know if Colorado's just tuning us out or whatnot. <laughs> yeah, I think he is. But I think he's also, uh, he's winning, so I think he's feeling a little good right here. Okay, you're just gonna bat with him through the top. I do love that top can be sitting on the ground and they can just run up and kind of bat with him through it. Yeah. It's the same how, how Bayonetta can witch time items that are just sitting on the ground. Yeah. It's so silly. So far we've seen more Pithra strings attempted than in either of the first two games. Yep. Nice up tilt. Uh, I was gonna say, this is like a, a spot where you really want to see uh, Pyra go for an up smash. Because uh, if... Ooh, takes it with the side beat. If you can stand under a platform and pressure enemy characters, especially other characters that are like slow, if you can pressure them underneath the uh, the platform, you can catch a lot of air dodges with Pyra up smash since it's so big. Yeah. And it's kind of got that delay to the start of. Yeah. Ooh, nice DI good. from Luma. He looks like, oh yeah, you saw him go for the up smash there, but he got hit by the top. And, and another smash F smash again. going back to game one. This is not Ooh. bad for uh, Colorado, but it definitely is not where you want to be right here. I was going to say, yeah, you ready to grab? Yeah, yeah. What? Okay, good air dodge. Now this might be... Uh, nope. I, I like Still the patience. Not... Ah, oh, you can't do that. You can't double switch. Luma up basically a full stock here. And Colorado switching to Pyro to try to do some sort of camera probably. All the way across the stage. Almost yeah, but... Spike. Switching to Pyra is really good to go for uh, damage, but at the same time... Oh boy, do you just get uh, you just get comboed yeah. and you have nothing you can do about it. But he's not completely out of it yet. That up air actually almost takes it, because Mithra up air does a surprising amount of knockback for absolutely no reason. They decided to give the combo more oriented one just a killing up air for whatever reason. Yeah. He needs it. And I was gonna say, yeah. you do not have many options in that scenario. And Luma finally takes it. Yeah, Luma's starting to pull back 2 1. I'll be interested to see now if we see a stage swap or not, or maybe even a character swap from uh, Colorado. I wouldn't, I mean, I would say to keep rocking with it, but I mean, I'm not gonna tell him what to do. Rocking with it. Figure out what's on Mor or what's on uh, Luma's mask. It's like flowers. I can't really tell though. Yeah. Ooh, we got a color switch. Two, and going to Mithra. yeah. Lilat for some yeah. reason. Yeah. Don't love this. Um, I'm sure this is partially to do with like the slants, like making gyro at ledge stuff kind of yeah. optimal. Um, keep the platforms that he's been using for things like uh, hit throw up smash. And it's also just a growth stage. Yeah. Ooh. We're gonna say down. Yeah. Even with the slant slide. Yeah. Down air to up smash. Down air to up smash so is good. just gonna work. They need it. It's fine. 45% from a couple tilts. Nice grab. Finally actually calls out the, uh... Ooh, yeah, nice down tilt. Frame almost killed. I wonder, is it easier to two-frame because you can kind of go under that ledge? There! That's what I wanted to see. I get the hook to be, yeah. Uh, so 
That was an interesting interaction, but he does yeah, not die so for it. There was a missed tech in there somewhere. Yeah. Ooh. That should probably be it. Yep. Yeah. I want to see, uh... I want to see forward smashes, but not ones where, uh... You're at kill percent like that. Ooh. That was a really risky switch. If he got hit by that top, he was dead after that switch. Yeah. Ooh, the Ooh, top delaying the, uh... Yeah. Delaying the up air. Alright. Room was doing his best to bring this back, though. Already up to 63. Yep. But all it's gonna take is... Ooh, Ooh. he almost got the setup there. I don't know if the setup missed because he did it too slow, or if the setup missed because Lilat pushed him away. Yeah. You get a nice up B, and then... Oh, gets the air dot. Oh my god, it's so close. Oh, he, uh... He held... Uh, up B on Mithra, so she got the slower up B, and he was able to punish her for it. Alright. This is Lumo's tournament stock. And he's looking to hold and on to he it. got it, yeah. And that's the Rob, who could have guessed. Game five. So many game fives. Every Fortnite, single game. Or an tech the only set that hasn't gone max games. He's just too buff. Couldn't be on couldn't be on screen too long. Scared the scared the viewers. Not Tim Prater though, he's just chilling in the background. Going to Yoshi's. Stop the battle. Hi Bryce. Bryce is in chat. Oh. Hello. Hello, Bryce. Why won't you be in spotlight, you coward? Tim, oh, Tim's punching him. Tim's trying to show him who's boss. Alright, here we go. Going to Yoshi's. Interesting. Just because it is so small that... I mean, they're both going to be getting probably some really cheeky early kills. Um, yeah. The, do they have a wall jump? Um, <laughs> That's a good question. I don't yeah. think so. Yeah. But they very well could, and it would not surprise me. Yeah. Like, I know Rob doesn't. At least I hope not. Shoot it and just make it home to do. Could you imagine? Oh, really? you imagine if Rob had a wall jump? That'd be so silly. It'd be so, it'd be so funny. Yeah, that's yeah. uh. One reason to go to the stage. You can use high platform to come into that. Mithra's uh. It is up there having such it, such high base it, knockback. It combos into itself. It, it needs it. Yeah. Okay, but Luma doing a good job of keeping this as close as he can. Luma wants that room back. Wait, no. Luma didn't play. Yeah. Wait, was it with Tristan? Yeah, he did. It was. That's right. They both want that room back with Tristan. Yep. Ooh. Ooh, thank you. just missing barely. And, yep. Was, I, it didn't seem like great DI, but I don't know if Optimal with DI would have even lived there. Yeah. Mizzer is just barely missing some of the stuff that she needs. I should buff her. This is looking like it might be the end. And it's over. The back of the Beyblade catch him. No, yeah, no, it's over. And it's over. Yeah, it's... If you, uh, if you get missed for that far off stage without a jump, nothing she can do.